Baseball, America's pastime. If you're like many Americans, you probably love this sport. You have your favorite players, your favorite teams, and you've probably even dreamt about playing in the major leagues. Well, Fantasy Baseball gives you the chance to feel more involved with your favorite athletes and professional baseball. Now, if you're as excited about baseball as I am, you probably want to go and get started right away. But before you pick your league and draft your team, you should know about the different options that are out there. The typical ESPN.com Fantasy Baseball League has all the typical major league positions, just with five outfielders instead of three, and two flex positions for the infield, where you play either a second baseman or a shortstop, and a first baseman or a third baseman. It also has eight pitchers, which can be a mix of starters and relievers. Another option is to have the same setup as the last one, just with one infield flex position where you can play any infielder. Plus, almost all leagues have a utility spot, which is similar to the designated hitter in major leagues. If you want to be as realistic as possible when assembling your roster, there is an option to have a standard Major League Baseball setup with all the infield positions, three outfielders, a DH, five starting pitchers, and two relievers. You should also know about scoring options before you pick your league. There are three main scoring options used in fantasy baseball, rotisserie, head-to-head, -head, and total points. Rotisserie is where there are multiple scoring categories that compile stats throughout the year, and you get points based on how you are doing in those categories relative to the other teams in your league. Head to head is where you have a matchup with another fantasy team each week and whoever has the most points at the end of that week gets a win. Total points is simply where all the points scored during the year add up and whoever has the most points at the end of that year wins. Now that you're ready, it is time to join a league. The process is pretty simple. To do so, simply go to ESPN.com Hover over the Fantasy tab and click on Baseball. From there, click on Join the League and then click on Join a League once again. After that, you can pick whichever league you want to join. If you wish to use a different website such as Yahoo, Fox, or CBS, the process is pretty similar. Once you've joined your league, enter the online draft room at the scheduled time and pick your players. Well, it looks like my work here is done. All you have left to do is study up on a top player's ranking list. I wish you the best of luck as you embark on your fantasy baseball journey.